Hello everyone. Uh, I have another book I want to share that I'm really excited about. And those of you who got the Picatrix already, um, this will be a companion book to that. It's called Lunar Astrology. It's by Bo Guang, an attempt at a reconstruction of the ancient astrological system. And here on page 17, um, it begins with the interpretations of the 28 mansions in different traditions. So uh, they're going to tie it together. You have the Chinese system, the German medicine, uh, all the different traditions that uh, they could get their hands on, including the sidereal revolution of the moon in relation to the zodiac. So um, I found, I, I'm really excited about it. We have to zoom in on it to get a better perspective. This was originally done in French. Uh, this author has several more books that have been translated into English. Um, and they're going to just go through it all. I found it, uh, having read the Picatrix, and then being offered this, of course, you can see Mansion 1, 0, 0 to 1251, 26 degrees of Aries is Almac. They are using the names in the Occidental, which means Western tradition, and we get that from the Picatrix. That's the name of the Picatrix. Um, so to keep that in mind, and yeah, they're even going to mention it right here. Um, so this is going to be an addition to that work. Those of you who would like it, um, I will have to send you a copy of this one. And uh, I can include the Picatrix for those who don't have a copy of that. But uh, again, uh, Picatrix Mansions of the Moon and uh, Lunar Astrology. And this author has done one with Tarot, The Star Speed, 1933, Life of Moses, 33, Dreams and Stars, uh, obviously done their work. And their works through time, The Symbolism of the Eagle, which we just talked about in the last video, uh, which we can go through that as well. Finally, somebody bringing up the symbolism of the eagle in astrology. And to be your own astrologer, yes. And uh, it being my birthday today, um, again, I want to explain to all of you about a lot of my videos that had to do with time, the three lock box, these calendars, what they've done to the zodiac, and to know thyself. And this is part of Know Thyself. And to know what the calendar was, or your star chart is on the day you were born, uh, that is you. It tells you everything about you. Um, to know thyself. Um, in every aspect, uh, the inner planets and the outer planets rule our inner lives and our outer lives, our subconscious. And a lot of this is going to come into play in the next few years where the outer planets are concerned, especially um, Saturn, Jupiter, and Pluto. And all of this is going to help us here. To me, when Jesus said, in my Father's house are many mansions, he was talking about the mansions of the moon. Because the sun, you have houses of the sun, but you have mansions of the moon. And uh, that's why I study this, and I found it. And like I said, I want to get more than one uh, culture telling me something, a second witness, before you can actually say this has not just uh, been added later, but it is original. And this is from the ancient works, being reestablished, and they're bringing them from everywhere. So uh, drop me an email and ask, you have to, at this point, I've offered so many books and different people are watching at different times that you have to tell me you want Lunar Astrology and, and or the Picatrix or any of the books that I've offered to you. That'll, and I've tried to give you some of the best ones and the oldest ones. And some of them are 
hard to read, I know. I have some others in the King's English that I'd like to offer you, but the language is so structured that you would literally have to have a dictionary to understand what you were reading, unless you were familiar with that tongue. Because it's like 1300 English, and it's really archaic. All right. Uh, and, of course, you can see the list over here. I'm going to try to get some of these other books and works by this author in English so that uh, I can share them with you all. Okay, Lunar Astrology, Companion to the Picatrix. Everybody have a great day.